One of the celebrities on Counting On, Jason Duggar, just got married to his sweetheart Maddie Grace in a gorgeous fall-themed ceremony. However, as one might expect, there is some controversy around it. Fans are conjecturing that Maddie may have been pregnant before to the wedding, and the whispers are intensifying. Stay tuned as we dissect all the information and explain why the Duggar fanbase is giddy about this. We have some great baby news to share next. The third child that Ginger Duggar and Jeremy Vulo are expecting was recently revealed. They already have two lovely daughters, so is this another baby boy they're having? The duo has been hinting at things, and their most recent podcast may have revealed something hey guys. Welcome to Brave, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Is that a girl or a boy? We'll get all the details about Ginger and Jeremy right now. On a more depressing note, six months after their terrible loss, Jill Duggar and her husband Derek Dillard have opened up about their journey of grief and healing. They recently shared a very personal moment visiting the burial of their stillborn daughter Isla Marie. We'll examine this touching encounter and the meaningful message that Jill and Derek are sending out into the world. Finally, we're going to discuss a startling subject. Yes, Duggar followers are discussing the prospect of a family divorce. Jim Bob Duggar's strong views have always been that divorce is the ultimate betrayal. But according to recent Reddit fan discussion, two Duggar couples may be thinking about splitting up. Which pairs are the focus of attention? Now let's explore the conjecture. To ensure that you never miss out on the newest Duggar drama, be sure to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell. Located on the famous Maddie Grace and Jason Duggar exchanged vows in a gorgeous fall-themed wedding in the Tennessee Highlands earlier this month. The Duggar family and most of their admirers attended the celebration, were given access to a preview of the big day via Jason's stunning old images on Instagram. Although the wedding appeared flawless, spectators are left guessing about the time of the nuptials. Jason and Maddie's engagement hashtag, hashtag spring 2025, indicated that they were initially planning to tie the knot in the spring of 2025, but the couple abruptly changed the date of their wedding, causing many to wonder what had caused such a rapid shift. Some fans have conjectured that Maddie may already be pregnant as a result of the abrupt change in their timeline. These stories have gathered hold on social media, and some people have added gasoline to the fire by speculating about how the family may explain the math if Maddie delivers baby soon. Though there have been indications of a romantic trip to Italy, Jason and Maddie have been noticeably quiet about their honeymoon plans. Fans are wary of the couple's determination to keep their whereabouts a secret. Is this secrecy an attempt to conceal Maddie's suspected pregnancy for the time being? But that's not the only reason why people are talking about Jason and Maddie. In one of Jason's most recent Instagram stories, he disclosed that he and Maddie watched the movie Mamma Mia which is about a woman who must choose between three men for her fatherhood. The newlyweds have already stirred up controversy by rejecting some of the more traditional values of the Duggar family. Reddit users were quick to point out that, given its themes that contradict the rigid upbringing the Duggar family is known for, Jason's parents, Jim Bob and Michelle, would probably disapprove of this movie. Joy, this is not the first time members of the Duggar family have disobeyed the customs of their family. Because they were attending dancing classes earlier this year, Anna and Austin Forsyth made news. Additionally, Ginger and Jill Duggar have both written books that criticize the lessons they were taught growing up and their family's engagement in the Institute for Basic Life Principles, IBLP. Is Jason and Maddie going to be the next couple to reject the rigid values of their family? Whether or not the pregnancy rumors are true, Jason and Maddie are undoubtedly forging their own path as a married couple. Fans are curious about how far they will go to defy Duggar traditions, given their unexpected wedding and choices like watching Mamma Mia. What do you suppose Maddie is anticipating already? Was it the couple's intention to begin their life together earlier than anticipated? Please share your opinions in the comments section below. Next, we have some wonderful news from Jeremy Vulo and Ginger Duggar, who recently revealed they are expecting their third child. They are already parents to two stunning girls, Felicity and Evangeline. Joe's admirers are giddy with excitement as they speculate about the possibility of a boy baby this time. The duo has been teasing fans for a while now, and their most recent podcast episode may have revealed something. So is it a female or a boy? Let's dissect everything for Ginger and Jeremy. Ginger and Jeremy announced their wonderful news of growing their family earlier this week. 
fans were enthralled with the couple's announcement once more, and ever since, they've kept them in the loop by dropping clues regarding the baby's gender. They already have two gorgeous, beautiful daughters, as everyone knows, and this time they've given the reveal one a little more mystery. A significant hint was revealed in Ginger's little vlog, in which she captured the moment she informed Jeremy they were expecting their third child. Talk about a double celebration. Jadra surprised him with the news on July 17, Felicity's birthday, which made this even more wonderful. In addition, Ginger shared on camera her experience alerting their family and her trip to the doctor for a blood test to confirm the baby's gender. She said that while the test results confirming a girl are mostly accurate, they can occasionally be off, particularly when they indicate a boy. Does this imply that a son is on the way? That's where the intriguing part starts, though. Ginger and Jeremy indicated that they already knew the baby's gender and were preparing a joyful gender reveal in their most recent podcast episode, in which they revealed that they are now 16 weeks along with a March 27 due date. And this is where the story takes a turn. Ginger retorted that the pool was already blue when Jeremy made a joke about using their pool for the gender reveal during their talk. Was this only a coincidence or was Ginger implying something subtly? Is this their way of revealing to us that they are expecting a boy? Regarding Ginger's prior visit to have her blood drawn, fans are also conjecturing. Even back then, there was some enthusiasm surrounding the prospect of having a boy. Jeremy has been a proud girl dad for the past six years, but everyone appears to be considering changing things up and adding a boy to the mix, especially them. Having said that, it's evident from their podcast that Jeremy and Ginger are keeping things lighthearted and aren't disclosing too much just yet. They've also stressed that having a healthy child is more important to them than knowing the gender, so it appears that we'll have to wait a little while longer for their official gender reveal. What do you think, Duggar fans? Are Ginger and Jeremy going to have their first child together? Or are they going to have another adorable girl? We can't wait to see what sort of invented gender reveal the pair has in store for us. They will undoubtedly share more in the upcoming weeks. Make sure to follow the celebs to get the most recent information about their travels. Six months after the tragic loss, Jill Duggar and her husband, Derek Dillard, visited the grave of their stillborn daughter, Aisla Marie, for the first time. The couple shared this emotional experience with their followers, providing an insight into their ongoing journey of grief and healing. Of course, this is the big reveal when it happens in a heartbreaking and deeply personal moment. We're discussing a tale today that appeals to a wide range of emotions. Jill and Derek's heartfelt visit to Isla's last resting place and the poignant love message they carry with them now. The 32-year-old Jill Duggar shared a video to Instagram of her and her son Derek and their youngest child, Freddie, selecting flowers to be laid at Isla Marie's grave during their heartfelt visit. The family was excited to present the floral tribute in honor of their newborn daughter after learning that an Aisla's memorial marker had been installed. We just got the message that Aisla's memorial is ready and has been installed, so we are going to run over to her cemetery and go visit her marker for the first time and we're going to offer her some fresh flowers," Jill said, expressing her feelings to the camera in the video. After that, the darkly lovely film moved to the cemetery where the family found Aisla's memorial a painful reminder of the young child they had lost. The tender moment when their son Freddie was spotted placing the flowers on his sister's tomb demonstrated their unwavering love and remembrance for Islam. Islam is on Marie Eilas Marker. Marie Dillard was born on March 19, 2024, into the arms of Jesus. Her parents, three older brothers, and numerous family members adored and missed her. The inscription serves as a moving reminder of her brief but extraordinarily significant presence in their life. Jill used a description for the photo that perfectly encapsulated the bittersweet moment of Islam. Marie Dillard, our baby girl, our eternal love. I hope the flowers are to your liking. The pair has previously expressed their sadness in such an honest manner. Three sons, Israel, age 9, Samuel, age 6, and Freddie, are also the parents of Jill and Derek who got married in 2014. 1. Sadly, this wasn't their first miscarriage in 2021. They named their third child River Bliss, after Jill disclosed that she had miscarried. Being expecting our third child made us very happy. We started miscarrying a few days after she revealed in an earlier Instagram post. River Joy, you are loved and missed. In October 2023, Jill shared with her followers her love and anguish for her lost children 
being open and honest about the emotional toll these losses had put on her. On October 21, the day we lost our third baby to an early first trimester miscarriage, Jill wrote a tribute to River on the two-year anniversary of the miscarriage. Dillard, you were adored from the beginning and will always be remembered. River happiness. Asla Marie, our darling girl, will always be in our hearts and our hearts will keep you till we hold you in paradise. The Dillards had a little funeral for Isla in April of this year. The ceremony was full with flowers, a small white box, and a stuffed rabbit. They announced that island together in a combined Instagram picture. Just one week after the funeral, on April 19, 2024, Jill uploaded a candid and tearful photo of herself with the caption, I carried you for every second of your life, and I will love you every second of mine. As they continue to honor the memory of both Islam Marie and River Bliss, Jill and Derek's journey through loss and grief has been extremely personal, but they have chosen to share it with their fans, providing a window into the anguish and love that comes with losing a child. Their candor makes others who have suffered similar losses feel less alone. We at the Fame send our sincerest condolences to Jill Derek and her family, and we hope that their narrative can provide solace to anyone who are experiencing similar circumstances. Finally, we're talking about a subject that may surprise some Duggar fans, the likelihood of a family divorce, as we all know. Jim Bob Duggar has a very strong marriage-based belief system. In his view, being divorced is the height of betrayal and it is expected of couples to remain together through thick and thin. However, there has been speculation recently on Reddit among fans that not one, but two Duggar couples may choose to break Jim Bob's strict guidelines and go their separate ways. Which pairs are the subject of conjecture? Now let's get started. First off, it should come as no surprise that Josh and Anna Duggar are the subject of the most of the rumors. Josh has long been a contentious figure in the family and is currently serving time in jail after being found guilty on charges relating to child sexual abuse. Some Reddit fans have expressed their belief that Josh may start a divorce after being released. Fans are curious as to whether Anna will stay by her husband in spite of his transgressions or if she would eventually leave him in light of everything that she has endured. One Reddit user even indicated that Josh would decide to end his marriage after he is released from prison and no longer feels the need to maintain the family's reputation. Other users conjectured that after years of devoted waiting, Anna might find herself abandoned when Josh is released. However, Josh and Anna aren't the only coupling grabbing attention. Divorce rumors about Jessa Duggar and her spouse, Ben Sewold, are also very popular. Although they might look stable at first glance, viewers have noted that Jessa doesn't seem to be content in her marriage. Some people think that Ben is a symbol of the power Jim Bob has over Jessa's life and that her father, Jim Bob, basically chose Ben for her. Many of her fans have expressed optimism that she will leave Ben in search of a more satisfying life, and they are rooting for her to break free from this dynamic and establish her own path. A Reddit poster even predicted that Jessa will leave Ben behind and discover who she is when her children are older. Jessa may be pregnant once more, according to rumors, which might make matters more difficult. However, a lot of admirers are hoping that she would finally take a risk and speak up for herself. Regarding this relationship, Reddit has long been split. Some believe they'll persevere, while others are certain a breakup is imminent. Therefore, is a Duggar divorce on the horizon? Fans are definitely keeping a watch on Josh and Anna as well as Jessa and Ben, even if it's all speculation at this point. Given Jim Bob Duggar's strong views on marriage, any divorce inside the family would be quite shocking to the Duggar community. What are your chances that one of these couples will defy the Duggar customs? If you are looking for more Duggar family exclusive gossip, come back to Brave for all your updates. Bye guys.